So I'm now here, folks, inside the cabin and uh, like a Jersey from school with Steve. Steve, um, we've got a model here. We've just got the Explore plant and transport machine JCB outside. We've got to change an avoidance zone because we've discovered something. We've actually done some work where the utilities are now, Steve. Tell me about how you're going to do that and then we'll be able to see the screen recording on this and also it coming into the cab in a live sense. So tell me what's going on. Okay, Peter. So this is Connex. This is our cloud-based platform that we use for sharing data to the machine and then both back to the office from the machine. So on the screen at the moment, we've got the reference file, which is the rail safety area, and we've got one avoidance zone on there, which is the virtual wall. What we're going to do now is we're going to show the process of how to upload a new avoidance zone and transfer it to the machine. So we'll go through it step by step. We'll upload the model, yep. and then instead of saying to the machine we want to use it as a reference or we want to dig to it, we're going to tell the machine to use it as an avoidance zone. And then that's automated. As soon as that goes onto the excavator, the operator doesn't have to press any buttons to kind of trigger it. It's all ready to go. So somebody can't cancel an upload no. or anything like that. So no. this is safety at its best, folks, when you can't tamper with the, with the safety solution that's coming in, isn't it? So yeah. um, so go on then, Steve. What, what are we going to do now? Are we going to hit a button? How does it all work? So we've got some extra data. We've got some yeah. data from the, uh, from the GPR survey. And all I'll do, I'm in files now. I'll go to upload. Right. And then it says select a file to, to upload. Yeah. So I'll choose a file. I've got something on a desktop gas in rail area. That's very important, folks. So I'm going to click on that, open, yep. and there it is, yep. ready to go into Connex. But right. you might be able to see here we've got a data type, and at the moment the default is reference model. Mm -hmm. All I'm going to do is click that banner and say, actually, that's an avoidance zone. Right. Okay. Then the next important step is to say, what machine is this going to? Is it yep. all my units? But for this, I'm just going to say, it's going to the Explore JCB. Fantastic. And upload. So then, folks, magically, that's going into the air through the, through the likes of the Wi-Fi connectivity we've got here, into the cloud, into Connex, and then that Connex system, that is the Leica Geosystem system, is basically picking out the location of the JCB machine that you've just put in there, and then sending that to the tablet inside the machine, isn't it? Absolutely. Simple as that, folks. Really important as well that we've been able to do that uh, and put the actual avoidance zone in when we've completed some work uh, just moments ago. Yeah. So let's see that coming in to the machine right next to us right now, folks.